time until helicopter arrival. 70 hours. Oh, hey. Frank, you there. It's me, Otis the Janitor. You said you're a journalist, right? I've been watching the monitors here and got some info you might want. There's some young guy wandering around in Paradise Plaza. He's carrying a camera like you. Take. He must be a photographer. I guess he must be a photographer, too. Taking pictures at a time like this, you're both crazy. <laughs> Scoop Q. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Blue bar means you got more than six hours. Every minute in the in this game is five seconds in real life. And it actually adds up to quite a bit. Because in mathematical terms, it'll take... To do five days in this game will take 14 hours in real life. All right? And now yellow will mean less than six hours remain. Red means less than three hours remain. And nothing there means there's no time limit there. And you kind of messed it up. All right, get a guide arrow. Yeah, put the watch. And no, it was already there. Oh, by the way, notice how slowly we're going right now. Whoa, wee! Oh yeah, wee! Yeah, fast is the way to go. Cause I'm a fast man, fast man. I, I just completely made that up. Right. Uh, lawnmower. <laughs> Quite gory, don't you think? <laughs> no, it's no, and I don't mean that by it being related to Al Gore. But, let's proceed on. Oh crap, someone's shooting at me! Hi! No, that's not even a joke. Oh, ho! Oh. You know who that is, right? And, uh... Yeah, you remember him, right? You're, uh... Girlfriend sent me to find you. Who? Jesse? Damn it! Okay, we'll have to talk about this later. You know how to use that gun? I've never fired at a person. All right, I'll cover you from here. You need to stick to the shadows. Try to get close to the target, okay? And what am I supposed to do when I get close? What do you think? Well, the best solution would be to shoot the guy. But if you can't do that, keep him busy dodging your bullets and stay out of trouble. Are you up to it? I'm a lot better with a camera. But yeah, I'll give it a shot. <laughs> All Get right. it. Next time he reloads, I'll lay down a suppressing fire. I'm counting on you. Make your way over there. One, two, three! Alright, time for our first boss battle. And, oh yeah, I got him. For watching that cutscene, I got an extra gun. See, now I got two pistols. Pretty cool, huh? But I picked up this SMG for a reason, because the handgun is absolutely uh, useless. Ow, 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 ow. You are very mean, dude, and I do not appreciate that. Oh, yeah, apparently he knows some weird terrorist kung fu. Oh, hey, I got him. Huh, that was quick. But seriously, that was funny how uh, Frank was like, What am I supposed to do when I get close? Seriously. So apparently, we just beat a boss battle. Against the kind gentleman that we met on the roof. got away who was that anyway I don't know and I don't care well thanks for your help the name's Brad I'm Frank West photojournalist 
And right now, I'd rather have an explanation than your thanks, Brad. Sorry. I've got nothing to tell you. Look. I don't know what Jesse told you. But as far as I'm concerned, we're through working together. So you cover your zombie story and leave the rest to us. You, uh, you guys are looking for someone here, aren't you? Hmm? Who is that? Where did you, you take You help it? me, I help you. <laughs> Damn. You're one hell of a journalist, aren't you, Frank? A hot headed, underhanded, hotshot paparazzi with nothing better to do than to invade people's privacy. I try. You got a point? You win, Frank. Let's work together. Jesse and I are DHS agents. And yes, we are looking for the man in that picture. You're with Homeland Security. Is that guy a terrorist or something? I took that picture in the entrance plaza. Right near the front door. The entrance plaza. You're sure? Hey! So do I have your permission to cover this story? Or not? <sighs> Alright. So we just successfully rescued Brad. And no... You cannot leave the whole boss fight up to him. He does eventually die. But it's kind of hard to do that on the first one. But, yeah, Psychopath defeated bonus. Yeah, the bosses in this game are called Psychopaths. And I plan to defeat every one of them as part of doing the perfect run I intend to get. Dang it, I hate the ones that wear hard hats. Because it's like, when you use auto-aim, Frank only aims for the head. That's how you regularly aim, and it takes up a lot of time, and it does that. Sorry, Brad. <laughs> Whoops. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but, should I use the shotgun or save it for later? Yeah. How about we use this, baby? Bah. Bah. Da. Me, 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 me. Wee! Oh, whoops. Uh. Oh, whoa, 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 crap. <laughs> I almost hit Brad. Oh, yeah. The chainsaw dies very easily. Yeah, weapons die, actually die in this game. The guns die for a reason, because they run out of ammo, but... The, the melee weapons themselves have ammo because, I don't know, they like get worn out from beating up zombies. Woohoo! Up! You son of a. Oh, yeah, Grand Slam. Yeah, pick you up, toss you! Thank you! Yeah, roundhouse kick, bitch. Sorry, Brad. Now let's go into the entrance plaza. And that is a picture that I took earlier, like a couple months ago when I was playing this game. <laughs> uh, you'll see what that was later. <laughs> 